Hello everybody, welcome back. This is Neil and R, and today we're going to play some more Dragon Age, the Velgard. So when we last left off, we made it outside the Fey, found some friends, sent one of ours back to their camp to get healed up, and now we're going to go explore this forest and look for answers. Basically, we got to find Belari, the Tora, another uh, Fey explorer. Fade Explorer, I should say. One second. Okay, we've got right, somebody out right. here. Oh, I didn't dodge. Huh. Gotcha. Nice. Oh, people. Where'd you come from? Ballara? Ballara Luter? Strife in Ireland sent us to find you. Wait, didn't you used to be a veil jumper? You left with Varric. What was your name? Rook. At least that's the nickname Varric gave me. Lace Harding. Protocol is to wait a full week before they send anyone out to look for me. I've only been gone three days. <laughs> well, the situation's changed. For the worse, unfortunately. Our gods, Elgernon and Gilanane, they've escaped from Fen Harel's prison, and by all accounts, they want to destroy the world. Oh, yes, that is very much for the worse. Okay, wait. I need a second. Yeah, it makes it's sense. It's a lot to take in. It does sort of explain a few things, though. Like what? The surge of raw magic in the area. These artifacts started waking up a while ago, but in fits and starts. One here, a couple there. Then, a couple of days ago, the sky split open. And now, raw magic. Thick as fog. Only a god, or gods, could have done that. There's something kind of exciting about it. And dangerous. Really dangerous. Dangerous enough that I was gonna head back to the Veil Jumper camp, but... But what? See that shimmer? That's a Veil Bubble. It's separating us from the rest of the real world, so to speak. You can only pass through it one way. Once you're in... You can't get out. Well, that's not good. I think I'd prefer to stay in one piece. Yeah. Right, me too. But I think I can find a way out. A bubble like that? There has to be something at the center that's generating it. Something powerful. If we can find it and remove it safely, I mean, the bubble itself should collapse. And then we're back in reality? I really, really hope so. Well then, let's get going. Okay, so we got a third in our party member. Like always, I think with this game, you always have three in your party at a time. So this wasn't where we started out walking down, but... I've been trying to get to the artifact at the center of the bubble. But these magical constructs keep getting in the way. We've handled our share of demons. A few dozen more shouldn't be a problem. Spirits, oh, down here. not demons. They're animating those suits of armor. The armor's attuned to the artifact to protect it from threats. Threats like us, I'm guessing. I look around here. Never know what might be hidden where. Nothing in there. Okay. I had to check. Okay, back on the road. Oh, got something here. Some heartwood. Good, good. Here we'll find some use for that. I oh, need to check back up there. There's something back there. Man, such a beautiful game. Look at that. Old Elven technology wonders. Back when the elves had power. Oh, yep. Yeah, see, I told you there was something back in here. 
Maximum tools and 31 gold. Sorry, girls. I, I got a scavenge while I'm going. Okay. Where we go up? Is there anything good down there that I need to just wander? Don't see anything, so we'll go ahead and go up. Anything hidden back here? Yes, there is. Is that water just swirling into the air? I've never seen that kind of magical anomaly here before. We call it the Whirlpool. They're not usually this big, though. That's kind of cool. That it is. See what's down this way? You don't want me to go up that way, but I gotta go. Something doesn't look copacetic here. Oh, I got some large truffles. That's the edge of the bubble. Can't pass through. We need to shut down the artifact first. Okay, well, I was looking for goodies. Keep wanting to hit my uh, jump button to run, but too many different games played. Hammer is the big one. Okay. See what's in this castle. Demons! Right where we need to go. Then let's deal with them. Let's see, what do you have? I got a skill point upgrade. Let's see what I can upgrade. I think that's the one I want to go with. There we go. A little bit higher, but yeah, I want to go into the survival, and I haven't decided if I'm going to go over more specialized as a champion or a wheat reaper. I have a feeling a pipe can do a, a champion, more of an attack based, from what I can tell looking at it. We're in Elven Temple. So what is this artifact we're looking for, exactly? I have a couple of theories, but nothing definite. We might find some clues in the ruins, though. Oh, we're definitely going to be looking for things in the ruins. Most definitely. There might be some good elven loot here. Okay. Nice to find ruins that haven't been picked clean. Ooh, that's actually better than one I have. Most people are too afraid to go this deep. In into Arlathan, except as fail jumpers. With how wild the magic's been here, I don't blame them. Okay, now I should be able to change my gear. 
And yeah, this one. A little bit better in defense and ability damage. I can't do the range or still tossed. Well, that looks cool. I, know, I probably wasted her heal, but so we re mana up here as we're going through. Wanted to test it out. What was this place? Could have been a temple, could have been where they stored food. Wow. I've never seen anything like this. Wait, is this? No, it can't be. Not here. Can't be what? We have to get over there. The artifact we're looking for must be inside. It almost feels like an armory or something like that. What's an armory doing this far out? Warlords. Ancient elves had a lot of them. That means equipment. But we also gotta make sure we, uh. Oh, a flawless crystal. Nice. Yeah, we gotta, we gotta keep an eye out. You never know when we find little goodies like that. You know me, I love my goodies. Let's see what's up here. Take a small little jump down there. Anything in the cove? No. Are we just supposed to jump across? Oh, no, we can make a bridge. There should be a power crystal somewhere nearby. Oh, I think I found it. Got it. Bring it over here and slot it in. That's a great trick. Nice. A resonance amplifier. It's drawing magic from the ring temple to this area. I need to shut it down before we can go up the path. But doing that will attract anything nasty that's hanging around. We're ready. Check room, be to dodge when you see it, okay. Oh, you gotta go out, buddy. I don't like it. You hold still, buddy. I can't get my super combo attack on you. Oh, you gonna attack from up here? Magic energy. Pat should be clear ahead. Yeah, but anything good here before we go that way? Nope. Looks like that's everything. Okay, let's go ahead. Oh, there's something over here. Has to be. Yeah. See, I knew it. Ritual. The big one where the sky was ripping apart. You say that was Fen Harel? I mean, the real Fen Harel? That's what I've been told. Though right now he goes by Solus. And 
Sorry. The things that got out, the big scary ones, that was Gilnane and Elgernon? Are you okay? You sound a little flustered. Oh, you know, just finding out that three of my gods are out there trying to end the world. Why wouldn't I be okay? Oh, one of them's trapped. I guess he's sort of the good guy. I will go after you in a second, buddy. You just hold your horses there. I wonder how they died. Even Major. First, I know we found the Usurper's archive spirit. It's not the Dreadwolf's creation, as we surmise, but another. You can guess. Who's moving it could be risky, but leaving it equally so. I wait your orders. Lord Agronon from Captain Atani. They just have trouble with the artifacts here. They expect them to work like, you know, normal magic. But they're different. The magic's more alive somehow. Okay, well, I think that's everything in the sides. If I missed something here. A hardwood. Oh, we'll be right with you, your automaton. Magical construct of the evil. Watch out. Whenever you see one, there's more nearby. How do you say that? Well, let's see what's in the temple here. Seeing these kinds of ruins never gets old. Can anything here tell us what that artifact is? I have a theory, but we're miles away from where that artifact should be. Okay, that door is good. I'll close it. Bring it over this way. Put it back in. Honey, I'm home. Hmm. Nice, uh, another chest. Oh, well, that's actually a little bit better than my mallet. I'll go ahead and equip this. That way when I do do my uh, axe, ooh, I'm going to have to play with that see how well it does. Whoa, 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 whoa. We got way too many here. I'll try it on these, but wow. Now I gotta look around a little bit before I do whatever does activate them. Plus we'll get this uh, opened up a little bit. It means I was right. Right about what? About where we are. The armory. And I think I know what the artifact is.
Hey, let's let's go through the door of this armory area. So, what kind of artifact shows up in an armory? A weapon? An archive spirit? A what? A creature of the Fade, bound to a crystal. Our ancestors used them to store knowledge and to help them dream. Oh, see something over here we've got to grab. Hey, come on, girls, let's go up the hill. Oh, those are nasty beasts. I can just hook back my sword and stuff for these. Ooh, yeah, he's ugly. Mythalinast. Dark spawn. Here. I never would have believed it. Until today. Hey, well. I'll look around here. Another one of those resonance amplifiers. Get ready. Once I shut it down, the path ahead will remain blocked until the magic dissipates. We've got your back. We'll take care of that in a second. That's the path ahead, so what's down below? We gotta look at that before we do this resonance thing. That's down here. I knew there was something. Another flawless gem. Hey, let's do this. These are easy. I don't mind these. Nice, Rook. Nice moves. That's it. I've never seen Dark Spawn this deep into Arleth and Forest before. As far as I know, it's never happened. If the gods are blighted, like Solus claims, maybe they're communicating with the Dark Spawn somehow. Directing them? You saw those Dark Spawn, though? Something was different about them. And we'll stop them once we get out of this bubble. Right. Let's get to that central temple. We will, we will. See, there's, there's gold to be had in these here rooms. And we gotta look all the way around, never know what we'll find. That looks like it could be dangerous, so I'm not going to hit it. The wall looks weak here. I bet we could break it somehow. More 
dark spawn, right where you broke that wall. This is kind of fun, shooting turkeys in a barrel. Okay, let's go. Okay. That was fun. And another resonance amplifier. Should be the last one, I hope. Me too. Go ahead and throw a little health in me. Take this out. I'm gonna take care of these guys up here, looks like. No other trinkets here that I see. Let's see, we'll go with that. Think we're at that, please. Okay, let's go see if you're right about being close. That was so cool. Have you noticed something about the blight? Where it is, I mean? It's almost like it's feeding off the elven magic. Can you heal that up? There you go. Looking around. The stench of decay fills the air. The Evernerists now wield power beyond anything I've seen. Their magic is fueled by corruption and death, and creeps even now into the stones. We cannot outlast this siege. That's ominous for them. Okay. Crystal. Okay, got some common material and some gold out of that. Good. I know this is more of a hack and flash than normal. But it's still good. Good graphics, good playthrough. Storyline's not bad. Teaches you a little bit more about the old elven world. If that building's what I think it is, then the alignment means we're here. This is it. This is where it was kept. Where what was kept? The archive spirit, or as the ancient elves called it. The Nodis Durthalin. It means the inevitability of knowledge. What does that mean? 
I don't know, actually. The notes guy are down very here. clear on that. But I plan to find out. More constructs ahead. The inner sanctum. We're getting closer. Oh, you buy it and all that. Good. Anything else? Oh, we need a something to open that up. I have not seen. Oh, there's Looks one like right this door here. is going to need a second power crystal. Then let's go find one. Take this one with us. But there's one over here in this door. Makes sense. Okay, we got one of the two. Missing one, and the other one's over there, so let's do this. Not Estrithalin. I have so many questions for it. How do you ask it questions? It's an archive spirit. <laughs> You'll see. Dang it. But we got the Raider Cleaver axe out of that. Physical damage is 77. I gotta wait until I get healed. Let this run its course. I don't think I have anything. I didn't think I had anything. Okay, so we'll go ahead and use the heal potion. And then go back to character. I do have this buckler, which is actually better. Let me whip it. And then this guy says this is better. Hey. 
Oh, it is fast still, so that's good. I was afraid it was going to be slow, but it's fast. Can't break any of that up. Oh, here we go. No gold there. Okay, here it is. The Nautis Thurthalen. So we take it and we're good, right? We can head back? Oh, I wish. No, it, it, it's a lot trickier than that. Right, because darkspawn, demons, and animated suits of armor aren't tricky enough. What do you mean by tricky, exactly? If I remove the artifact the way I'd usually do it, it'll explode and take out half of Arlathan with it. Good news is, I think I can shunt the energy somewhere else. Okay, here we go. The way the magic is pulsing, I've never seen this before. Something's gonna it's come with like us. Breathing. Big old demon. Ogre! That's an ogre! They are the harder they fall. Well, wasn't expecting to fight an ogre today. Then again, I also didn't expect to learn that my gods are rampaging around and trying to end the world. Just one of those days. <laughs> He's just too tearful. Okay. Let's see. There we go. Ooh. No, no, no. That's good. I think. Oh. Oh, what does that crystal do? Keeps the artifact powered. Focuses the ambient magical energy. That's why these things still work thousands of years later. Oh. No, you don't. <laughs> There we go. Sulanan, Vir Sulevanan, and Asal Dirthara. Well then. I am the Nadas Dirthara. Right, um, I have questions. I am the Nadas Dirthara. What do you. 
You broke it. Where'd the spirit go? The Nottis Dirthalan, I mean? It went back into the crystal, but the crystal's broken. Until I fix it. It's kind of my thing, fixing magical stuff. Strife in Ireland will want to know about this. And the Blight, and the Darkspawn. Let me know when you're ready to head to the Veil Jumper camp. Yeah, we gotta make sure we got all the loot in this area, because... Hope we filled up, so we don't need that. I'm thinking there, yeah, there's stuff over here. That's potions. There's a chest. Storm. That's actually... Better than what she's wearing right now, so we're going to go ahead and upgrade her. Companions, now I can work on their stuff. Cool. Let's see. Work on her attack. That looks good too. Make sure she doesn't have any more equipment? No. Okay. Harding. Nothing new for you. Nothing new for you, okay. Unive. Nothing good for you either, okay. My skills, I do have one more. Yeah, this one will allow us to bounce projectiles back. That'll be good. Of course, library we won't worry about. And the map. It looks like we go out... Can't go up there. Okay, we got everything we can do here. It's our next adventure. We will go out and about and see what we can find. So hopefully you enjoyed this episode. I thought it was pretty interesting. And we will see what we get into on the next one. So like always, give me a like, give me a subscribe, and we'll see you on the next one.